Gross. <laughs> he shit himself. Okay, yeah, let's skip that. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that's pretty. The rest is just talking and talking about fucking shit. Hmm. So it is true. You know, I, um, I spoke with Dee briefly, uh, yesterday. I'm gonna be honest, I, um, I straight up asked him. I was like, hey, you <laughs> yeah, I, I, uh, I sat him down because I wanted him to, I don't know, I guess for my own personal reasons, I wanted to give him a chance to say something just like I'm giving Pez a chance I um I straight up asked him I didn't say I didn't say we've been speaking I didn't say anything that you know we've talked about I just straight up asked him hey have you spoken to anyone about what happened with uh with Cleo um And, uh, wait, hold on, give me a moment. Wait, chat, what do you mean muted? Hello? Can you not hear him? Can't hear Colin. What? Wait, uh, say something. Something. Chat, what? What do you mean? No, it's, it's max volume chat. He's just moved. What? Hello? He wasn't talking. He just wasn't talking. Guy, chat, you guys are fucking Papega. Okay, my chat. I'm, my head's fucking. Never mind. I was, um. Yeah, I straight up asked him. I said, uh. You know, did you speak to anyone about Cleo? I said, um. You know, maybe while you're intoxicated or under the influence of something. He said to me, I don't remember. I, n I never remember anything when I'm intoxicated. That already, I feel like, is a huge fucking issue. I know sometimes when you when you drink a, a lot, you know, some things can get a little hazy, but to completely black out every single time you, you drink. I said, um, has there ever been an instance where you've done something and then later found out you did that thing while intoxicated? said yeah I said uh what if uh what if you did do something while you're intoxicated this time and I said you know I know we're doing all this shit with uh with pears but you know as we say no one's above the patch and he looked me straight in the eye and uh and said so what if I did What are you going to do about it? What's the club going to do about it? They're not going to do anything. Even if I did do something while I was intoxicated, the club isn't going to do anything about it. He didn't admit to anything. He didn't even uh, entertain the idea that it did actually happen, even though he literally just said that 
you wouldn't be able to remember it anyway, unless that's just a lie as well. But he straight up said, you know, even if I did do something that would be breaking the, the rules of the club, what are you or is what are you or anyone else in the club going to do about it? And to be honest, I didn't. I didn't have an answer to that. He just kind of walked away, and then we just kind of went on with uh, some other shit. Can't hear Colin again. He's not chat. He's not talking. He's not talking. It's my job. Now he is talking. See? Fuck up. To deal with it. It is. Someone has willingly told a bunch of shit during an interrogation. And yeah, you can argue, oh, but he was drunk. So that's fine. You know, when you're drunk, you know, you say a few things. Wolfie was drunk when he said a bunch of shit in front of Hubcap and he was punished for it. And we said it today, nobody's above the patch. Yeah. We're, we're all held accountable for our actions. Every single one of us. And I care about this club. It's, it's what I die for. But... Much like when it comes to D with these things, I've made my mind up. I gave him the benefit of the doubt until I heard that. And I, you can hear very much during all of that, that it sounds like he's drunk, having a breakdown, Can't and very shut the fuck going up, through chat. something. Does that excuse his actions? No. Should we extend the same hand that we're extending to Pez? Yes. But if he says, what are we going to do about it? We're going to do something about it. And I think that's a meeting that... This club's got a habit of putting things off for a while, but this is something we can't put off, Barry. This is something that we have to deal with, and I don't know how we're going to deal with it. If he, if we have this meeting and he just says, yeah, I said it all, what the fuck are you going to do about it? Part of me wants to shoot him. Oh my god. Guys just texted me. I just... <sighs> fuck, man. This, this whole Pez thing uh... is back burner. Does any, where did you get this tape? Does anyone else know hey, about this? One person. Who is that? Pez. Pez knows about the tape. Has he, has he heard it? Yes. Oh my. Oh, and what? Because he's the one who gave it to me. Hey, I'll be at the billy five minutes. I was gonna say I got an S plus. Okay, Jesse, we have I I G love that I love Yeah, look. Let's deal with this and then we will deal with that, okay? And we'll one hundred percent do what it. Are you we even just doing? I was gone and then you were gone. I'm I'm just talking. I'll I'll, I'll be literally at the billy right after this. P just texted saying he's ready to talk as well, so we're we're gonna have to Can you uh, Jesse, I need you to get everyone to the billy. Everybody, every jacketed member. Where do you I, want them? Garage? Just, just in the billy. Just in the billy. Tell him, tell him I'm gonna be down. Just tell him P's ready to talk, and I'll, I'll text him. Tell him he's at the billy as well. Okay. I'll get, get right on it. Okay. Pez, so, sorry. Did you say he's heard it? Pez has heard it because he's the one who got it. And Pez said it to me. He said that this isn't his get out of jail free card. I was like, I basically told him, yeah. 
Like, he's ready to, like, I guess, face his actions. And, but this is just his way of saying that if I have to face the music for what I'm doing, then so does Dundee. Yes, hello. H hang rounds as well. Uh, no, fuck. Uh, no, fuck hang rounds. They shouldn't know about this shit. So, so everything above hang rounds, got it. Just get jackets. Yeah, anyone with a yep. jacket, get them the billy. Just yeah, get hang yeah. around. Hang around to me. Yeah. Yeah, fucking hung up on me, cut. I was literally about to say before this as well. Um, you know the Pez shit. I want all the jackets there to witness it. The stuff I. I was honestly just gonna say you, me, and D go, go out and fucking talk about it, but it sounds to me that it's most likely all gonna happen at once. I, I think it should just be us three. I don't think we're gonna have an option, Colin. I, I think Pez is gonna bring it up, and we need this could be the only time we have to chat with P. And if we if we don't do this now, then why don't we I, just ask P to bite his tongue? Just call him. Yo, Pez. I don't know. You spoke to Colin? Uh, yeah, we're just having a, having a chat now. I understand that. I mean, I'm sure you know the severity of that tape. <laughs> um, I do. Oh. <laughs> Everything I've done um, is just stems from that tape. I've got more to tell you, and I'd want to tell you and Colin in person, but Colin already knows that. Uh, yeah, this is. Uh, this is. Uh, he needs help. He needs help. This is this isn't a this isn't a. He needs to be punished, but he also needs help. I'm not turning my back on him, even though he's calling me a traitor. To fall in love with someone, he's destroyed their life. Yeah. I don't think I've done anything wrong, but that's not my that's not my uh my place to say. Regardless, I think um, the the only opinions on what's going to happen today is is obviously going to be up to us. Um, mm -hmm. I do want all the jackets that are, are awake to at least witness it. So when we whatever we talk about today, it's all out in the open. You know, I'm sick of sick of all these. Uh, you know, he said, she said, shit. Let's let's just deal with that today. It's clearly a big issue. Um, I'll get everyone to the billy. Just wait for my text, right? It'll, it'll pop up in the next few minutes, and then we'll we'll have a chat, all right? We'll we'll go somewhere and, and talk about it. All right. All right. I'll, uh, I'll text you soon. 